Hi, my name is Mary Molina. I am the assistant to the director of religious education here at St. Mary Magdalene. I have been a parishioner along with my husband and my three boys um, with St. Mary Magdalene for the past 16 years. Um, I have been employed with St. Mary Magdalene for the past seven years. Um, my job is working with parents and children in grades preschool through fifth grade. Um, and it is truly one of the best jobs I've had. I truly love all of our families that we work with. And um, it just brings me joy to come to work and be able to um, interact with parents and with their kids. One of my most favorite activities that we have um, at St. Mary Magdalene, and we have had this program probably for 16 years, um, is a program called Little Lambs. Um, I have been working with Little Lambs as a parent volunteer since my youngest was four, and he is now 20. So um, it is truly one of the highlights and the joys of um, working here at St. Mary Magdalene for me. Um, with that, I would like to share with you one of, the, one of my favorite stories um, that um, we do with the kids in Little Lambs. Um, before I do that, I would like to share a song with you. And we start our Little Lambs class with this song, um, When We Meet. Ready? Hi God, be with us today as we come to pray. May all we do honor you. And then I say, let's all do this together. Hi God, be with us today as we come to pray may all we do honor you my favorite story is jesus stops the storm and it's one of my most favorite stories because it reminds us that there is nothing that we need to fear because jesus protects us so when there's storms in life like there always are, we know that Jesus is there. We just need to call him. So with that, Jesus stops a storm. One day, Jesus taught a crowd of people by the Sea of Galilee. They listened to him teach about God's kingdom. At the end of the day, Jesus told his disciples, let's row to the other side of the lake. So they climbed into a boat and began to row. Jesus went to the back of the boat to lay down to rest. The lake was quiet and calm. The boat rocked gently back and forth. Jesus soon fell asleep. Suddenly, the storm blew in across the lake. Strong winds howled. The sky turned black with dark clouds. The waves grew and grew. Waves crashed into the boat. The disciples tried to row, but the wild winds waved the boat up and down, side to side. Soon, the boat filled with water. The disciples thought, we're sinking. We're all going to drown. So they went back to the boat to wake Jesus. They shouted, save us, Lord. Save us, Lord. We're going to drown. Jesus stood up. He spoke to the wind and to the waves. He said to them, peace, be still. The waves stopped tossing. The wind stopped blowing. The stars twinkled in a clear sky. It was perfectly quiet. Jesus looked at his disciples. Why are you so afraid? He asked. Don't you believe in me? Don't you trust me? Don't you know that I'm always here to help? The disciples were amazed. They said, how does Jesus have such power? Even the wind and the waves obey him. So the reason I love this story is because it reminds us that no matter what happens in life, um, Jesus is always near. We just have to call him. With that, 
Um, I'm excited to say that um, I might be able to um, start a Little Lambs class in the spring. Um, I wasn't able to start one in the fall. Um, so if you're interested, if you've got little ones in um, age three to five, um, please email me and let me know if you are interested um, and hopefully we can put a little lambs class together. All right, well, it was nice spending this time with you guys. Um, see you around.